and we go. Right, left, right, drop the left hip. Left, right, left, drop the right hip. We're gonna be doing two steps, right, left, adding on an undulation. Right foot and left foot, right heel is up, hands are behind the head, two own knees going in, one and two. Let's try that again, here we go, and right, left, right, drop the left, left, right, left, drop the right. Undulate on the right foot, now left foot, two omis going in, one and two. We're going to layer a sit shimmy on top of the pelvis roll. So you're going to sit into a plie and move your hips up and down. Whenever you layer a pelvis roll on top of this, it looks like this. You're pushing your pelvis forward, underneath, back and up. We're going to walk, so as you step, you're pushing your pelvis forward. As you complete the step, you will complete the pelvis roll. I count it like one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. So in order to layer the sit shimmy on top, we must be in a bent knee position. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. So you have drop, release, drop, release, sit, lift, sit, lift. We're now going to cross over with the right foot, traveling to the left. We will be doing a hip circle on the right hip, going clockwise. Push out and out and touch. You can also do an arabesque at this point if you'd like. Okay, so we're going to travel to the left with the right foot crossing over, doing a clockwise circle on the right hip. You're going to push out, out, arabesque. If you're not strong with your arabesques, you can always just touch your foot for balance. Cross over, repeat, out, out with the hip going counterclockwise. You can end the combination with eight counts of shimmy if you need to take a rest, but we'll alternate by coming into a back step on the Saidi rhythm. The Saidi rhythm is down, up, down, 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 up, down, down. So for eight counts, we'll walk back with that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight and then we'll start the entire combination on the left.